at a 45 degree angle. That's not here, that's not there, it's not there. Spread your fingers real big. Take your nose. I'm serious. Your nose. Put your thumb to it. All right. Oh, God, we're not TV. <laughs> and, and you want to be right in line with it, not in your nose, on your nose. Kids, kids, kids. And point it right there. Your nose should be pointed right to your thumb, just like that. Okay? And there's your hand in hand position. That happens on heel. Okay? Then we should do that. One, two, left foot. Go, double step. One, two, three, heel. Now hold that. Okay, and from here. If you want to do the Jerry Lewis face, you can also do the Jerry Lewis face. You can do double step. That's of course optional, as with all hand moves in my dancing. So, if you'd like to do the Jerry Lewis face and the hand, go right ahead. Video all you like. That was 13 years ago. I've been dancing for 13 years. Wow. Do you regret it? <laughs> no, I love every minute of it. That's how Donna and I met. We met at Six Flags. And uh, the team that I danced with at the time was the Footstomp and Hill Clickers from Gainesville, Georgia. And uh, we were there, and Donna's team, Master City Cloggers, were there. For uh, Big John Walters was doing a festival at Six Flags. And uh, I couldn't find no one to ride rides with, and so Donna said, come with me, so you won't be a fifth wheel. <laughs> First of all, people, when you learn to clog, don't give up no matter what, because it took me four daggone months to learn the basic steps. So keep at it and don't give up. Can you hear it? Sally Atkins from Columbus, Ohio with us today. Hello, Sally. How are you? I'm fine. How are you? Very good. Are you enjoying the workshop? Fantastic time. Very good. Can you tell us a little bit about your clogging background, how you first got started in it? Sure. Um, I start... Um, <laughs> you st want to start all over again? <laughs> all right. The, so that's just how you see how it's going to run, all right? I should We should have showed them a little bit of the video to see. Well, we won't talk, and I promise not to sing. It's going to be hard on Chains, because I love this song. Oh. Hi, I'm Dara Moreland from Plainfield, Indiana. And I'm Naomi Fleetwood from Columbus, Indiana. That's nice. Take, Take two. two. <laughs> Are you having fun this jamboree? I'm having a terrific time, yeah. Great. Thank specific people or a person that you admire the most in clogging? Queen of England. Steve Smith. Mom's dad's. I seen a lady out there that was pregnant. She looked like she was about to pop with, with uh, bare feet and everything. So I said, well, if she can do it, I know I can do it. Stevens, and I love Stephen Stomper's taps. <laughs> Hello, I'm Tammy Morrison, and we are here at the 1994th Annual Memorial Weekend International Clogging Jamboree. 
at the Hyatt Regency in Dearborn, Michigan, right near Detroit. Okay, this is Charlie Burns, and he's from Richmond, Kentucky. And Charlie's a national instructor. Charlie, how did you first get started in clogging, or who influenced you? Well, I did it on a dare. But that's what got me started. Uh, I had a friend that was uh, wanting to take clogging, and her husband didn't want to. My wife didn't want to, so she asked me to go to clogging lessons. And I said, I don't want to do that. Then she told me I couldn't do it, and she dared me to do it, to try it. And so I said, I can try it, sure. So that was a long time ago. <laughs> with us. Thank you for joining us today. Are you having fun at the workshop? It's a good workshop. Very good. Hot. Tiring. <laughs> yeah, it makes it hot in August, doesn't it? Um, can you tell us a little bit about your clogging background? How did you first get started in clogging? Accidentally. <laughs> we, were, we were square dancers that uh, went to a convention. They had a clogging workshop with Sheila Popwell. We learned four steps, I think. Bought a book, learned six more, and that was it. Pretty soon people started saying, well, what are you doing? How do you do that? That's how we got into teaching. This is Shirley and Doug McConnell, and they're with us today from Cornwall, Ontario. Mm -hmm. That's right. We're from Cornwall. Okay, can you tell us a little bit about your clogging background? How did you first get involved in clogging? Well, I was at a square dance convention in the States, and I saw clogging for the first time. My background had been a tap dancer, so I thought, I've just got to do this. So, um... I did see a few more workshops and so on and attended as many as I could and a group from Montreal, Quebec, saw me dancing and Doug is a square dance caller so he had the equipment and they said, um, if you start we'll drive from Montreal to Cornwall which was about an hour's drive and so a group from Montreal got me started. <laughs> ¶¶ 